Listen closely, my child, for I have important words to share. This is bound to take place, the unfolding of my perfect plan, the fulfillment of my promises, the culmination of all things. Do not be afraid, but be filled with hope and expectation. What I have ordained will surely come to pass. If you need God's blessings, then type yes I need in the comments. From the beginning of time, I set in motion my grand design for creation and for humanity. Though sin entered the world and brokenness spread, my redemptive purposes have never wavered. All of history has been moving towards this appointed hour. The pieces are falling into place. The stage is being set. This is bound to take place. My kingdom come, my will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Child, you were born for such a time as this. Your life is no accident, but part of my intricate tapestry. The gifts I've given you, the paths I've led you on, the trials I've brought you through, all have been preparation. You have an important role to play in these coming days. Take courage and step forward in faith. I will equip you for every good work I've prepared in advance for you to do. Do not grow weary or lose heart in the face of opposition or hardship. This is bound to take place. My purposes will prevail. My word will not return void. Though the earth give way and the mountains fall into the sea, I remain unshakable. My promises are yes and amen in Christ Jesus. When you feel weak, I am strong. When you are unsure, I am certain. My grace is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness. In the days to come, you will see both glorious wonders and terrible tribulations. Do not be surprised by the fiery trials that come upon you. This world is passing away, but those who do my will shall live forever. Fix your eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen. For what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. Set your mind on things above, where Christ is seated at my right hand. This is bound to take place, the refining of my church, the purification of my bride. I am jealous for my people, and I will not share their affection with idols. I discipline those I love. Submit yourself to my refining fire. Allow me to burn away all that is not of me, so that what remains is pure gold. Cling to me alone as your source of strength and identity. Take heart, dear one. This is bound to take place, the building of my kingdom, the expansion of my reign. What the enemy meant for evil, I will use for good. The trials and persecution my people face will only serve to spread the gospel further and faster. My word will go forth to the ends of the earth. People from every tribe, tongue, and nation will bow their knee and confess that Jesus Christ is Lord. Do not grow discouraged when you see darkness increasing. The light shines brightest against the blackest sky. This is bound to take place, my glory revealed, my name exalted in all the earth. Every knee will bow, every tongue confess that I alone am God. Those who have rejected me will weep and gnash their teeth. But you, my child, will rejoice with joy inexpressible. In these last days, be vigilant and alert. The enemy prowls about like a roaring lion, seeking someone to devour. Put on the full armor I provide, belt of truth, breastplate of righteousness, shoes of peace, shield of faith, helmet of salvation, sword of the spirit. Stand firm against the schemes of the devil, resist him, and he will flee from you. Draw near to me, and I will draw near to you. This is bound to take place, the triumph of good over evil, the victory of light over darkness. Though battles rage, the war is already won. I have overcome the world. Death has lost its sting, the grave its victory. Nothing can separate you from my love. Neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation. Beloved, do not lose sight of my promises. This is bound to take place, my glorious return, in power and great glory. I will come like a thief in the night, so stay awake and be ready. No one knows the day or hour, but the signs are clear for those with eyes to see. When you see these things taking place, 
Look up. Your redemption draws near. On that day, I will make all things new. I will wipe every tear from your eyes. There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain, for the old order of things will pass away. You will see my face and bear my name on your forehead. You will reign with me for eternity in perfect fellowship and joy. Until then, hold fast to what you have. Remain in me, and I in you. Apart from me you can do nothing, but if you abide in me you will bear much fruit. Let your light shine before others, that they may see your good deeds and glorify me. Be salt and light in a dark and decaying world. Preach the word in season and out of season. Always be prepared to give an answer for the hope that you have. This is bound to take place. The separating of the sheep from the goats, the wheat from the tares. Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Char, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does the will of my Father. Many will fall away, their love grown cold. But those who stand firm to the end will be saved. Be faithful, even to the point of death, and I will give you life as your victor's crown. Do not fear what is to come, my child. I hold the future in my hands. Nothing can thwart my plans or stay my hand. This is bound to take place. All I have decreed, all I have promised. Heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will never pass away. I am the Alpha and Omega, the first and the last, the beginning and the end. Trust in me with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge me, and I will make your path straight. Even when you walk through the darkest valley, do not fear, for I am with you. My rod and staff, they comfort you. Surely my goodness and love will follow you all the days of your life. Remember always that you are mine. I have called you by name, you belong to me. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you, and when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned, the flames will not set you ablaze. For I am the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, your Savior. This is bound to take place, the consummation of all things, the ushering in of eternity. All creation groans as in the pains of childbirth, waiting eagerly for that day. The sufferings of this present time are not worth comparing with the glory that will be revealed in you. Eye has not seen, ear has not heard, nor has it entered into the heart of man all that I have prepared for those who love me. So take heart, my beloved, lift up your head, Set your face like flint towards the goal. Press on towards the prize of the upward call in Christ Jesus. Run with perseverance the race marked out for you. Fight the good fight. Finish the race. Keep the faith. A crown of righteousness awaits you, which I, the righteous judge, will award to you on that day. This is bound to take place. My perfect will accomplished. My eternal purpose is fulfilled. Nothing can stop it. Nothing can delay it. My word has gone forth and will not return empty, but will accomplish all I desire and achieve the purpose for which I sent it. Therefore, my precious child, stand firm. Let nothing move you. Always give yourself fully to my work, because you know that your labor in me is not in vain. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or discouraged, for I, the Lord your God, will be with you wherever you go. Trust in my unfailing love. Rest in my unchanging character. Hope in my unshakable promises. Rejoice in the certain knowledge that this is bound to take place, all I have spoken, all I have planned. Your future is secure in my hands. I who began a good work in you will carry it on to completion until the day of Christ Jesus. I love you with an everlasting love. I take great delight in you. I rejoice over you with singing you are engraved on the palms of my hands. I will never leave you nor forsake you. You are mine, and I am yours, forever and always. Beloved child, your super thanks empowers our divine mission. Click the button to join us in spreading God's message of truth and enlightenment. In return, receive boundless blessings from the depths of His love. My child, the trial before you is almost over. Your long-awaited blessing is about to arrive. Your payment is about to be due. Remember, 
None of my children are excluded. Whenever you approach me in faith and truth, I will respond. My promise to you is true. Your faith has not wavered. It remains strong in times of weakness and temptation, when the road becomes difficult to move on. But you didn't fall into the enemy's trap. You have come a long way by choosing to persevere and move forward with patience and determination every day. You go on unswervingly, and I will always be with you. Now, you're almost there, that good place where you and your family can find the peace you want, the organization you want, and new happiness. This is a time that requires new ideas, new goals, new desires, and more determination until victory is achieved. First, when we overcome our bad habits and deeds, we are freed from all mental chains and the remaining anger ends. As you and your family soak in the refreshing waters of the Holy Spirit, your lives will experience profound and glorious change. Although some of your friends and relatives will notice the change and be surprised, they will come to you with different questions, asking what has changed and why you feel happy and different. So I tell you again, the problems and concerns you have now will not last forever. You don't have to deal with the same problems forever. You have given your heart to me. You have accepted my words and commands, and you truly believe that I am your heavenly father. I dedicate my life to you and your family for the sake of deep faith and truth. I am so happy to see your faith growing as you patiently wait for my good times and trust me with all your heart. You don't have to look for signs to believe because you know that my word is the only word that has the power to heal and bless. This is very interesting to me, and I am happy to confirm my desire to welcome you. Today is the most important day, the day of your salvation and freedom. Tell me your desire to follow me, to embrace my love, to remain by my side without hesitation. You know my love for you. You sought my blessings and I gave them to you. You pray for the health of your family, and I wish you health in all aspects of your life as your soul and heart continue to grow in my love. Despite all your thoughts, remember my plans for you are great. Your dreams are big because I put them in your heart. You are precious and you know it in your heart. There is an achievement waiting for you. However, always remember that my vision for your life is greater than your expectations. Therefore, I give you wisdom, peace, tranquility, and great joy. I'll guide you to the people and things you need on your journey. Your service to others will be marked by a pure heart and you will receive true love. Through these links, you can receive support and blessings. I place true friends in your path who will understand and appreciate your worth. If I am ready to send you my blessing, please embrace me without hesitation. My blessing is not an expression of your kindness, but of your status as my beloved child, worthy of my best efforts. I hope you use what you receive wisely and to help those who are grieving and suffering. I am committed to strengthening your home and family. Trust me, follow your faith, and follow my word. I can assure you that many aspects of your life will change and pave the way for future happiness and success. So, I ask you to say that your commitment to me is permanent. Believe in everything I give you. If I say I have blessed you, let your heart reply, blessings received. Trust my understanding of the path ahead and the steps we will take together. Take my hand, hold my heart, let me bear the burden of your life, a burden that you do not bear. I will go before you and my feet will be on fire and coals, but you will not be burned or injured. Even in the midst of a potentially explosive storm, we will overcome your problems together. Remember, I am with you and you will never sink. Put your fears aside and see the blessings that await you at the end of your journey. Share this video with up to three people if you need God's presence. Just like a child who has complete trust in someone he loves and cares for, maintain an attitude of pure faith and hope. Clouds will try to hide the sunshine of your freedom and separate you from the light that wants to shine upon you. Heaven and earth are me. Because I am the creator of all things, I command them. The winds of revival are blowing, the threat of the storm is receding, and the sun is shining through the windows. 
creating a wonderful view. Take a look, enjoy it. It is time to smile. You find happiness in family. Those who left will return. The wrong ones will see. The wrong ones will be born again. Especially those who turn to me and put me first in their hearts. I am making changes around you, some subtle, but others you will see. Many may be jealous, but many love it and talk about it. Amazing things are changing inside of you. You are alive and happy. When you are asked about your secret, you will say that I am your Lord, who wrote and completed your faith and your salvation, blessing you with the power of the resurrection. My name is Jesus, holy and powerful. Now close your eyes, kneel down and pray. Accept my blessing in your heart and preach with all your strength. Christ lives. Go forward with confidence in your heart. My forgiveness is real, just as your heart is washed in my blood. The gates of eternity will obey you. Celebrate this day of supernatural victory with dignity. In my name, you will triumph over the strong, and you will triumph over everything you do. Your prayers and patience will bear fruit. Your time of waiting and worrying is over. The sleepless nights and anxiety, endless despair that once plagued you are now gone. You are freeing yourself from strong feelings. I humbly heal your wounds. Remember, nothing is beyond me. I raise the fallen, breathe life into the lost, and heal not only visible wounds but also hidden ones. There is no need to be ashamed. I love you. I know you well, and I know your pain well. Those who envy you and resent your happiness will see that I will bring you abundant blessings. I will work a miracle in your life and make the pain of your past disappear into a distant memory. You are protected by me and surrounded by angels. However, I ask you to stick to the divine path that I have set before you. Avoid those traps that you do not agree with. Do not follow them. It is better to act alone than with those who would prevent you from doing good. I am also working in the hearts of judges and strong-willed authorities. I arrange for you to be victorious in all your legal battles. Victory has been declared in heaven, and my angels are on the way to release you. Your worries will soon become a memory. May your face be beautiful, stand strong and smile with the strength I give you. I am your defender, fighting against all who oppose you. May the faith you possess shine in your eyes. You are ready for victory. Its preservation and disclosure are as follows. Stand firm in the face of your adversaries. I have the final word. And victory is yours. Listen to these words. When you understand this miracle, return to your room, kneel down, and most importantly, give me your life. Enter your loyalty. Seal it with my blood as I fulfill my covenant of everlasting love with you. Accept this with all your heart. Speak to me your loyalty. Do not be afraid, do not panic. Stay strong on the path I have set for you. Do not stray from the position I have given you. Resist discouragement and do not let the present blind you to the blessed future that awaits. Your spiritual vision is unmistakable. The challenges you face now pale in comparison to the wonderful blessings of the future. They are real and near. Never doubt that you can achieve your dreams. You are not defined by failure or other problems. Admiring eyes wish you blessings and happiness. They know your kindness, and I know you too. But do not panic. You will not be able to stop my plans. I come to comfort you today. I understand how stressful it is to take that next step, but I encourage you to regain your faith. The sea may not part, but know that I am strong enough to walk on water. Today, I grant supernatural strength to your steps. I make my presence felt. I am here to heal the wounds within you that feed the fear, doubt, and hesitation that hold you back from growth. Go forward. Trust me, my future is greater than you can imagine. Don't let the temptations of the world get you down. Your life can change dramatically in a short period of time. Forget the past. Don't fear the future. Accept my love and power now. If you want to listen to God's message and bring positive changes to your life, then subscribe to the channel. I strive throughout your life, and wherever I am, there's always a chance to start over, always a chance to write a new chapter. Let me shape your future with my powerful hand.
I can completely change your life. Do not be angry at what you see. Relying on visions alone can lead to depression and fear. Instead, live your life by my words. Listen to my voice, take the Bible, think about my teachings and live by faith. Believe in my power, because with faith, even the impossible can become reality. I love you very much, and I promise you that your future will be very different from your past. I see it. I don't want you to experience the pain of shame. I don't want to see your story of suffering repeat itself. It's time to heal the lingering wounds in your heart. You must rise above the past and take only the lessons you have learned so that you don't return to old ways. I invite you to trust in me and find comfort in my arms when your soul is heavy. And don't be afraid to shed a tear. Let me bring you closer to your true self. I understand your journey and what you are going through. And I offer you compassion without judgment. You are genuine and compassionate. But those who cannot love you back have been hurt by your generosity. You gave your love to those who did not know your worth, leaving you alone to face despair and loneliness. Now, I ask you to lift your head, listen carefully, and trust my promise that those negative experiences will not happen again. From now on, trust me completely. I will keep you on the right path, and my presence will always be present in your life. Feel free to talk to me, share your deepest thoughts, and lean on my shoulder when you are tired. I do not want you to believe those who deceive you and those who talk about love to deny your faith. My child, I invite you to read my word more carefully, to know more about who I am, to seek my presence passionately, and to accept the purpose for which I have chosen you. My presence will always be your friend, comfort, and solace. A new life filled with joy lies before you. In the future, your days of sorrow and tears will turn into times of joy. When you see another tear fall down your cheek, let them be tears of joy, for they will respond to the fulfillment of my promise to you. Believe in me. Fight and run into my arms. You are here too. Nothing bad will happen to you, because anyone who wants to hurt you will argue with me. I really love you. To end this message, I want to give you two words that will strengthen your courage, give you strength, and give you peace. You are mine. The powerful blood protects you and shields you from all dark forces. No spell, spell, or charm can touch you. Your soul is beyond imagination, and your life is indestructible. No evil force in the universe can harm you unless you are covered in my blood, covered in my love, and filled with the Holy Spirit. Hear these words. Your spiritual growth is essential to your blessing. If you are afraid of the past or of the curse I am releasing you from, I cannot offer you more than this. If you want to walk beside me, you must be willing to change your mind. If not, I can remove some of the distractions in your life that may be making you uncomfortable. I know your love for me is real. Do not take my love for granted. You must not underestimate the depth of my love for you. Do not ignore the saving power of my blood. You will not go back to your old ways, nor ruin your new life with past mistakes. Now is the time to avoid making the same mistakes again. May you be forgiven and blessed with many things. If you have a hard time understanding what I have to offer, perhaps you are not feeding your heart with the right food. If you ignore my words and follow advice you don't like, you may fall into despair and confusion. These deceivers may look like angels of light, offering a beautiful path, but their purpose is dark and out to lead you to destruction. A defining moment is coming, a time when you will work hard and fight bravely with the resources I have provided for your loved ones. Hear me out. This is not just about you. My spirit lives in you. You don't need anyone's help to be happy. Share this video with up to three people if you need God's presence. Bring these two words close to your heart every day because they support you and encourage you. I love you. The next success will be so profound that your past pain will fade into insignificance. The disappointments of the past have hurt you. You have accepted empty promises, and you have forgotten that I am the only doubt in your life. However, my love is deeper and sweeter. My touch will heal your broken heart, and my words will heal your despair. Do not be afraid, 
because I will also erase the scars of your past betrayal from your mind, the marks of shame and bitterness. I long to heal your soul and ask you to surrender to my will. My goal is to restore your dreams and fill a new passion in you. I invite you to fly with me on a journey beyond your imagination, to spread your wings and soar until you reach higher heights. Your enemies seek to crush you, destroy your dignity, and take away the courage I have given you. Even if they cause you worry, remember that you are worth more than all the wealth of the world, and your strength is in me, your Heavenly Father. Although the forces rose up against you, but this time you stood in faith and deceived those who wanted to destroy you. Your faith is in me, not in fallen man. Your life and heart are mine alone. I will break the ties that bind you to those who betrayed you. From now on, remember that only you are your God, and only I have a place of honor in your life. I will give you eternal life when everyone who does not promise safety and happiness on earth will betray you. Don't fall into the trap of fraud again. You will understand my situation. You know how much I love you. I love you. Wherever you go, I will find you. Any power that harms you will meet my wrath. I protect and love those I love. Your worries are gone. Your whole body will be filled with great joy. Tell me you agree with this. I love you. I want you to hold this truth. Feel it. Take it into your days and feel this love right where you are. You want someone to confess their true love and value to you. Now hear me clearly. I love you. You are important to me. Do not forget that every day I show you love through many resources, which all testify to the desire for your well-being. Open your heart to recognize these gifts as they are given to enrich your life and ensure your success. I gave you the strength to win. I gave you the spirit of victory. Your sins are forgiven, the past is erased, and your life is changed. I turn to your heart. Remember my love for you in times of sadness, hurt, or despair. When circumstances block you and you cannot see your way, when darkness covers your eyes and you feel directionless, know that I am with you. I will not leave you. As your spirit rises and you face your battles, I am there in every triumph and victory, through joy and sorrow, through health and happiness, and when there is plenty or need. These words are meant to encourage and encourage you to. Wow, it's a lot to do. Don't rely on your own strength. Follow the promises I made, they are your ship. Let go of your worries and trust in my eternal love. I will hug you and lift you up. Surround yourself with people who care about you, respect you, and value you. See how I see a miracle in your family, beyond your need and beyond your imagination. I influence the hearts of your loved ones. I shape their thoughts and actions. Be courageous and determined. Don't be discouraged or discouraged. Stay strong because I will be with you wherever you go. I love you as always. You know this. Keep praying for your family. They are in my care. Hope your prayers are answered to improve their lives. Follow your prayers. Child, for what you are looking for, even for what you do not see, because everyone needs a lot of spiritual help. When your loved ones leave the house, I will go with them, protecting them from harm and evil. You will find peace knowing that I am in charge of your home life. The worries and sadness that surround your days will soon disappear. With my help, your family union will be stronger. I will destroy those who sow strife and envy, but you must forgive and love them. Do not respond to their provocations, and you will see that their abuse will stop. I brought you into this world to embody and spread my love as a symbol of my goodness and understanding through the example of your life. Many people in your family come looking for change. They see your calmness and change and ask what has given you this new peace. This is your chance to share how I can change your life and convince them that I can do the same for them. Keep praying for your family. Although you may not be able to change certain situations or be physically present for your children and loved ones, remember that I am all-powerful and always present. Because of my great love for them, I will be your representative. All souls are precious to me, and my concern goes out to all of you who love me. Your work is simple, but powerful. Kneel in prayer. Leave the hatred or pain in your heart, and trust in my perfect timing. 
Leave your worries to me and you will see great changes around you. If you still doubt my ability to reach out and change someone in your family, please keep your faith. I have the power to change my mind, to change my attitude, and to renew my heart. And you will soon know these truths when they are revealed to me. You have my word. My blessings are upon you. My dear child, know that you are truly loved. You are very special to me. I have great plans for your life and they will come true. I will guide you to the right path. The magic you need and the answers you've been looking for will come to your fingertips. Your heart's desire will come true. If you take the time to pray every day, seek me in the stillness of the morning and kneel before you go to sleep at night. You will know and the answers you seek are already spreading around you. As you immerse yourself in my words, you will see the world through a different perspective. Your character will grow and even those who oppose you will begin to change their ways. Your hope will be revived, your smile will be brighter, and the confidence that can be seen on your face will be appreciated by others. Remember, you are not lost and you will never be. I give you life and strength to overcome all circumstances, live and find happiness. Just as I rose on the third day, you also rose with me. Embrace this truth, believe it, and fill yourself with the divine power you need to emerge from the chaos you are in and move safely to your destiny. Through thick and thin, I'm with you. You won't be in trouble. If you cross a swift river, you will not drown. If you step on a burning fire, you will not be burned. I have given you the strength to overcome all diseases, and nothing will touch you. My blessings to you are endless and never-ending. I am your Father, to protect you, to wait for you, to protect you with great love. My love is not something you have to earn, just give love and independence. When it is necessary, call upon me in fervent prayer, and I will answer and reveal deep things that you have not yet known. Open your ears to my voice as I continue to speak of my deep blessings and love for you. Trials may arise, struggles and struggles and trials, but remember, you are mine. I love you so much. As your shepherd, there is nothing for you. Know your place in my heart and know that I have chosen you for your care and love. Show me your trust, declare in public. I am always with you and I want to hear your affirmation of faith. Say it, write it down. Let me hear what you believe. Listen quietly with true faith and your soul will find rest and peace. Even when you are struggling and life is not progressing, remember that I am with you. All of this is for your benefit, even if it doesn't seem like it. You don't have to wait for a storm to come before I intervene. I'm speechless again. If you've exhausted all options and still haven't found an answer or purpose in your trials, know that I'm here to guide you. But be patient and avoid looking for solutions in the wrong place. When the shame of your vision is dark, trust me with all your worries and concerns. You don't have to rely on your own strength. Fear cannot hold you back. I give you the spirit of strength, love, and learning to overcome all challenges. Your thoughts are not your reality. Even if you do not know my presence, your steadfast faith is the sun, my Holy Spirit is the wind, pushing you to freedom and blessing. If you want to listen to God's message and bring positive changes to your life, then subscribe to the channel. My dear child, your feelings are precious. Your dreams are clear, and your heart is soft. I invite you to place everything you have in my care and rest in the care I have for you. From now on, do not let any doubt remain in your heart. Wait for my great promise. Always believe, because I am always by your side and I will never leave you. When fear tries to overcome you and the sea of temptation seems impassable, remember that I am with you, tenderly meeting your needs. You shall not be afraid. You cannot die. When discouragement tries to hinder your progress or when fatigue blocks your path, remember that I am right beside you, ready to protect and guide you. I will wipe out your path and open a new door. In times of pain, when tears seem to be your only comfort, know that I am there to turn every tear into a blessing. No one knows your heart like I do. I know exactly what you want, what you desire, what you truly desire. I see more than others can, 
signs like shape or status. I look straight into your heart. The more you believe in me and support my plans, the more wisdom and strength you will gain. I am fond of you. You embody my qualities, determination, creativity, wisdom, and courage. Remember, when you are determined to achieve your goals, nothing can stop you from making progress. Accept this fact, you are my beloved child. But don't forget your individuality. You are beating yourself up. Your face is fighting your own strength. You are tired, you are frustrated. In those times of doubt and fatigue, I will be there for you. I want to guide you in the right direction so that you don't waste your time in vain or give up at the first sign of trouble. Believe that if you allow me to lift you up, you will achieve the true goals you have set in your heart. Only I can turn the seemingly impossible into amazing miracles. Please make sure I see you every day and that I will meet all your requests as a blessing. I want us to work together, together, and together on this journey. Your responsibility is to believe and trust. My answer is to give, bless, protect, nurture, strengthen, and pass on. Know this, my love for you will never fade and I will never leave you. My words are enough to win your heart back. That divine energy that flows when I speak, it's enough to awaken you and lift you up. You may think I'm unworthy to live in your home, but you see, I'm touched by your faith and humility. My interest goes deeper than visiting your home. I want to live in your heart. There I'll write the words that will break the chains that bind you. With my hands, I'll lighten your burdens and take away your fears, your anxieties, your pain. For even the heavens can hear me. I simply say that for your happiness, for your peace, for your security and the hope of a future filled with new life. When you come to me, you open your heart and embrace me. In the truth of my existence, you claim my deep love and protection as yours as well. This is my legacy in this life. Trust me with all your heart today and accept this gift. Your power awaits you. Your beauty awaits you. My spiritual power of healing and transformation is yours to receive. Do not let painful thoughts hold you back or admit that you must come to terms with past mistakes. Remember that even if you live in a world of trouble, it will be overcome. You are a victorious child of the Most High God. Trust and believe in me every step of the way, and you will overcome this world and its temptations. I know you spend a lot of time in tears, and sometimes you don't know why. Let me tell you, it comes from a deep longing to be with me again. Your heart longs for me, your spirit craves me, your whole body realizes that you are not worthy of me. My words come to you in a gentle voice. I stretch myself and feel life flowing through your fingers, while the peace and happiness you long for seem just out of reach. I stand beside a fountain of eternal blessing. The waters can purify your spirit and wash away all sorrow. Immerse yourself in these waters. Clear your heart of sorrow. You will never fall into peace again. For my words are faithful. I am deeply moved by your faith. Through it, you have been healed. You have opened the door for me to come into my life. I will be here to care for and bless you and your family beyond your wildest dreams. Invite me into every area of your life today. Open all the doors and windows and bring in my divine blessings to heal your soul and give rest to your weary heart. I have cleansed your house and there is no stain left. My breath makes every part new and my voice shakes the walls of your mind and lets go of the pain of your past. Now you are cleansed and forgiven. Accept this fact. My dear child, your super thanks powers our divine mission. Click the button to join us in spreading God's message of truth and enlightenment. Receive boundless blessings in return. Remember, perfection is not a promise. Temptation will come again. But like my child, dear, beloved, you are human. You will encounter difficulties, but my hand will always hold you. If you want me every day, call with all your heart and surrender yourself completely to my will. Please know that I will always be with you. Even if you fall, I'm ready to support you and pick you up. Understand that failure is not an option for you. When you face challenges, sometimes you may be kicked out of the game and face ridicule and shame, as if you are lost all over again. But I'm looking, 
I have chosen you for this battle, and it is my duty to cleanse you, strengthen you, and forgive you many times over. This is your path, and you must stick to it without resistance. Your enemies are cruel, heartless, and heartless. They are jealous of the robe of victory you have thrown at me, and they will use every tool in their arsenal to harm you with the goal of depriving you of the security you feel today. But when you listen to me and understand my words, you will protect your family and wish them happiness. You know, achieving this goal took hard work, faith, and keeping my word. Your blessing is near, and your enemies know it. That's why they try to stop you. They look down upon you and do not expect you to turn to me. Admit your weakness, and ask for my forgiveness and blessing. For this I have ordained your prosperity, success, and happiness. I am with you every day, and no one can overcome you or bring you down. If you fall, don't worry, I will pick you up. That's your morning appointment. You, your family, and everyone connected to your family, even those who are far away, will experience my presence in a profound, extraordinary way. Contact me and set yourself up for success. I decorate your heart with life, and I bring you new blessings. While others tremble, you remain steadfast, a warrior full of courage. During the day, you walk with a shield under my hand. At night, as you rest, I will whisper into your heart, telling you of miracles and clearing away traps that you cannot see. I will personally guide you, protect you from evil, hold you close, and lead you to the place where blessings await. Those who trust in me are like eagles flying by faith, seeking those who love them. They will climb fearlessly and bravely, fly in the holy clouds, and reach the pinnacle of refreshed spirit and indestructible faith. They will return home with courage and determination to find me and continue their unwavering faith, inspired by the powerful voice that gives them wings. If you want to believe it, a different reality is around you. When others only see weakness, your family will be protected and your table will be filled with food. Not only do I give, I increase your blessings. I offer you and your loved ones an objection that no obstacle can hold back. Get into the ditch, reach out and pray for the blessings of your faith. The owner of this garden is your heavenly father, and I have chosen you to prosper on earth. I have given you the power to let go of fear, defensiveness, and doubt. You no longer believe what your eyes see, your emotions are now strong. If you face new challenges, turn to my word. Relax and wait quietly for my spirit to speak. Give solutions and answer your prayers. If there are any questions, I will answer them. Don't be afraid of the forces of darkness or obstacles in your path. You will use the power of youth to overcome these obstacles. Your enemies will not be defeated by force or soldiers, but by the powerful anointing of my Holy Spirit. Your disputes are not resolved by war cries, but by seeking me. I'll always be in your room, in your heart, and by your side. Call me and I'll answer. Just speak and I will strengthen you with my grace and love. You can do anything. Your enemies are afraid. You have won with the sincerity of your heart. I promise you a thousand new blessings. Remember, this is not a sign of luck or strength. I bless you generously because I choose to bless you with love, an unwavering love. Although others try to get blessings through great works or religious displays, it is your true faith that sustains me. You know very well that I am honest. You believe that you can pass through the fire of danger without stumbling into the storm of chaos. Command them to stop, but they are. I give you the power to spread my love to everyone you meet. When you reach out with gratitude and humility, with the intention of helping others and doing good with a sincere heart, wonderful miracles will happen. My strength will not be found in great announcements or great signs, but in quiet hours you seek only me. I will meet you there and reward your faith. Miracles will accompany you when you walk around the world. Everyone will know that you are not alone. You heard my promise. Take it. Take it deep. Keep it inside. Combine your faith with the desire to know me better, and I will pour you out with my power. Be humble and grateful, and you will cover me. You need a miracle, 
a touch from me to release you from the pressures that cause you pain, confusion, and anxiety. You want peace and quiet. Close your eyes at night without worries, waking up happy. I came here to say I love you. Keep all my promises. I am your supporter and supporter. I am your shepherd and savior. I am your God who keeps you. I am your friend. Rejoicing with you as the blessings you promised come to your door. Hold on to this statement because I promise you that what you expect will happen. Many things will change in your life. Fill your mind with my healing promises. I encourage you to think differently and change your reaction when problems arise. Remember first that I will never leave you, even in heavy trials that will not lift. Remember that you will always be in my arms. I love you so much. How can I leave you after pouring love? You are my child, precious to me. When temptations arise and the enemy tries to find the key for you in chaos, do not forget that you are not forgotten or abandoned. You are a treasure, my love. I will repeat this to keep it in your hearts. Keep all my promises real, strong, and true. My contract with you cannot be broken. My commitment is permanent. I am always by your side. Attention to my presence. You must be in my love. I am your friend. I will not leave you. Current trials have little shadow. They will die again. Despite sadness and doubt, refuse to worry. Because I have everything in my hands. Remember today and always with eternal love, I love you. And with my strength, you will rise from the sadness to find joy again. Only in my presence will you find true happiness. If you find yourself under a cloud of trouble, trust in my word to light your way. Your enemies will tell of your failure. My belief is strong. Don't be afraid. Don't panic. I am with you in the strongest storm. I will carry you. And when it gets dark, I will be there to meet you. Let your tears stick. Tell me your great music. I'm listening. Your life is important to me. And I always support you that I am here now. And I will continue to show you how deep I am. You will be assured of my constant presence, protection, and attention to your needs and prayers. I like to order my angels to work for you. Seeing your faith in action, come to me with your desire. Although some say not to beg, I encourage you to seek me with all your heart and trust that I will take care of others. The day will come when you will know, before you speak, that I know what you want. Your prayers will not be in vain. I see the joy and strength of your faith. Remember, my love for you is infinite and I am always ready to respond. What I appreciate most is your patience and trust, especially when my time doesn't meet your expectations. I admire your willingness to wait, knowing I have the best. Be strong, because you cover me with great strength and loving care. The shadow of darkness is gone. Happiness returns to your life and home. This encouragement comes from my infinite love for you. I am ready to bless you and your family so that the world can truly see the depth of my love. My love for you, my love is not afraid. My mercy is not afraid. May these words bring deep peace to your heart. Every day, I want to bless you with all the wonderful peace and blessings, the best for your family. Keep all my promises. When you have faith in my word, it will keep your soul and enlighten your mind. Share this video with up to three people if you need God's presence. Note that this is not just about opportunities or issues. I speak my holy word, which shows when and how I think. You want to change, be good, live the life your family wants for free? Everyone who follows me with courage, wisdom, and truth. Your heart is set on change. I am ready to make this change. I can easily change my heart and mind, and I will. But your faith is important. You are entering new, unfamiliar territory. Let go of the past and move forward in faith ready to receive the blessing that I have for you. Judgment is over, your time has come. Today, I am ready to do great things in your life and in your family. So, don't cry behind closed doors. Talk to me, share your faith, write your thoughts. Show me that you believe in me and accept this word of comfort. Receive God's encouragement from above. If it is good news, on the other hand, a wider door is opened and better prospects emerge. 
remember that there is a spiritual attack on your life and your faith. Although the enemy will want to prevent your progress, visible and invisible, I will support you men who have been given the wisdom of the day to guide you. Humbly accept his opinion, pray, and I will tell you something else. You will win this battle and all the obstacles you face will be overcome. Of course, I can heal you quickly, but you need to protect your faith, skills and gifts. Realize that talent is not acquired by isolation. If you ignore my word and lose your faith, you will be vulnerable to the attacks of the enemy and you will be left in the dark. It is to achieve many things and bless many. Your family will also grow in wisdom and humility and will be successful in everything. But for this, we will go together. Take my hand. You are ready to reach a higher spiritual level where futures are shaped and lives are changed. And now, when you listen to my voice, great things will be done and the foundations of your house will be laid so that it will stand on a high rock so that your children will know how to serve me. For each of them, I will give special gifts, skills and activities, encouraging them to learn and succeed. Dream beyond your current thoughts, beyond your imagination, higher than you ever thought possible. Today, you and your family will not be spiritually poor or have emotional problems or go around worrying about money around you. No, baby, take my direction, learn to dream big. I am here to strengthen your faith and encourage you to receive the blessings that are coming your way. I will overcome all your trials and sorrows with strength. I will ease your pain, heal your heart with my love. Wherever you are, feel the warmth of my welcome, even on your busiest day. Stop for a moment and by faith, find the peace that hurts your soul and calms your mind. I will give you permission for the emotions that are bothering you. The bad news you will hear will weaken you and make your strength fall. But trust me, I'm here for you. Your trials are short now, but your future is anointed, blessed and protected. No enemy who wants to shake the feeling of weakness can stop your blessing. I can turn all opposition against his path, a perfect sword, and heal all the problems in your family and your family. My power is limitless, and it is my eternal desire that you receive all the wonderful things that I have promised. I am God, not a mere human. I will not cheat. I keep my mind from the beginning of time. I came to save you, to give you eternal life, to guide you in the right way. I am the way, the truth, and your life. I am your answer and your refuge. Therefore, I ask you in love, keep my promise. Do not let the lies of the world deceive you. It gives me joy to see your trust in me and to know that you will not allow the insults of those who encourage you. They try to destroy your peace and fill your heart with anger and confusion, with misunderstandings and irrational emotions. They want to see you make mistakes in your daily life, away from the truth, from my love, from my presence. You have seen the true thoughts of others, but I know that your heart is steadfast in love, a great love which has no name, and it surrounds you even in times of loneliness. I see your struggle, your fear, your tears as you cry for help as you ask for my help, when you are powerless in your situation. I heard you. Know, my son, that my love for you is deep and eternal. I never want you to feel abandoned or suffering alone. Even if you think I'm distant or negative, know that I'm not. Remember, you will always need me, regardless of your situation and how good your life is. Don't underestimate your care. The enemy uses such moments to shake your faith and destroy your life. But fear not, for I am with you in this challenge. It saddens me to see your hardships, and I don't want you to live in misery. Instead of focusing on what is wrong, transfer your worries to me. Reject any thoughts of failure. They have no place in your mind. You will not fail because you have put your trust in the Almighty. Do not give in to despair. To do so would be a big mistake. Those who truly believe in my power and expect my blessings will never disappoint or despair. When the urge to move on fades, keep the faith. You serve a mighty and great God who can reignite your passion and inspire your soul with eternal divine passion. 
Keep the promise I made today. Erase from your heart the words I have spoken to you. Ignore those who belittle your worth and declare you unworthy of life. They won't tell you your fate. I am willing. I hope you are living life to the fullest and will soon witness the manifestation of my blessings. The challenges that are weighing you down will be resolved. If you have heard these words before, know that it is not a coincidence. Prove your faith in me. We are committed to persevere even in difficult circumstances and continue to value our relationships. Your situation will improve. Your future will be bright. I will miraculously intervene and you will immediately see a clear path in front of you, a solution to your problem. Do not associate with the negative attitudes or pessimistic views of people experiencing spiritual failure. If you hear or read these words, it is because I have given you wisdom and maturity. The gate to your success is about to open. Believe not as something imaginary, but as the God you know intimately. Do not doubt my words anymore. Through every trial, I have been your savior, your comforter, embracing you with unconditional love and transforming your troubled past into a hopeful present. Let this fire burn in your heart as the dreams I dream grow more fruitful, soon to provide shade, sustenance and abundance for you and the people you love. Hold fast to the life I have given you and let your joy overflow because I am going to do things that will change your perspective. You will understand more clearly the plans I have prepared for you. Remember, despite my past failures, I have never left your side. I have forgiven you, lifted you up, and never left you heartbroken or forsaken. We look forward to a new day. Your present sadness will disappear, replaced by the endless joy of the wonders that lie on the horizon. Soon you will witness this miracle with your own eyes. Declare your faith and commitment now. Tell me, I believe. And, as I often remind you, I love you very much and have wonderful things for you. Take my hand and walk with me, step by step, towards peace and contentment. Speed of travel is not as important as your stability and endurance, maintaining calmness and steadfast faith without distraction. Focus on me and move forward. You will reach your goal, even though time may seem to pass slowly and the fatigue of waiting increases. Remember that you are too old to be guided by passing emotions. I am preparing to bless your family and prepare the way for them to face the challenges of the future without fear. Enemies will be defeated and resistance will be overcome. I do not promise an easy path, but I assure you that you will not lack faith and strength. Accept this encouragement, knowing that your victory is certain. Accept my sacred promises that will bring healing to your body health to your mind and strength to your heart. I am here to break the chains of despair and depression, to lift the burdens that make you doubt my promises. Today, I will end the deceptive relationships that lead you to failure. An extraordinary miracle can be achieved if you commit to following my guidance and clinging to my love. But choose not to follow those who give up and believe their destructive lies, who chase short-term rewards, seek superficial status, and desire corrupt power and worldly fame. They mistakenly believe that my presence is accompanied by pride and material excess. Reject this great deception. They reject my words. They reject my true nature. And they ignore him who came as a servant and sacrificed himself on the cross. But you have opened your heart to me, and I desire to achieve wonderful things in you. Adorn your soul with humility. Avoid deceptive temptations. I am here to support you, to give you peace and wisdom so that fatigue, complaining and doubt do not destroy your faith or happiness. Declare with all your heart, O oh Lord, I trust you. I trust you and I wait patiently for my blessing. I assure you that what you ask for will come true. Your faith in me and your prayers in the name of Jesus have been heard and will always be heard. I bring tidings of new seasons, times of heavy rain, clear skies, and blessings to fill every aspect of your life and home. You and your family will be filled with peace and happiness. Such abundance can be attained by those who believe in me, who obey my words in their hearts, and who await his blessings with patience and firm determination. My dear child, your super thanks 
powers our divine mission. Click the button to join us in spreading God's message of truth and enlightenment. Receive boundless blessings in return. Remember that precious things, like the birth and growth of life, take time to mature and grow. Your blessings are deep and powerful, and you will need time and patience to express your favor. Do not give up. Look at the horizon and slowly move from where you are sitting. Embrace change because it will serve you well. Surround yourself with people and things that will help you grow. Walk with me, and you shall not be defeated by your enemies, for I will be your shield and protection. You have seen with spiritual eyes the armies of heavenly angels surrounding you, the light of God guiding your paths and defeating your enemies. You will see how the world works for you. Soon, I will reveal to you the beautiful things in dreams and let you see heaven on earth. I am ready to move the world for you, for a faith as true and wholehearted as yours. Your love for me is strong, indivisible, and precious to me. That's why I'm happy to answer your questions every day. Every day may be a new challenge, but my love has you covered. Before you start your daily routine, please know that I appreciate your kind words. Tell me, dear friend, Jesus, I love you. Nothing can stop my love for you. I am ready to restore you and elevate you to your rightful place. A higher life awaits you if you give your heart to me and accept my love for healing and forgiveness. The promise I made to you has been firmly imprinted on your heart. If you choose to believe, do it with your whole body. Don't be like those who talk about love, but don't truly embrace it. Those who care more about other people's decisions than my affirmation. Those who tolerate others' ridicule. Many people will try to seduce you with their own selfish desires, saying they love you, but they will try to suppress you by making rules they themselves cannot follow. They clothe themselves with images of righteousness and false holiness, claiming to be noble. However, in my eyes, you are precious. Don't forget those who judge you as a sinner, a sinner, a sinner. To me, you can always find your true value. I invite you to have full freedom. Tonight, as you rest, may my presence bring you peace. May my Holy Spirit speak into your life, bring healing to your soul and mind, and break every chain that binds you. Tomorrow, when you wake up, you will have lasting freedom. Your happiness no longer depends on what others think. In the end, you will be like my children, endowed with wisdom, patience, perseverance, and strong faith. In the dark moments, when others hurt you with their words, when you are surrounded by shadows, when you doubt the path forward, hold on to me. Remember, you are mine and destined for great and beautiful things. Don't allow yourself to wallow in contempt and despair. I'm here to love you, help you, forgive you, and bring you back. I promise a future of strength, creativity, peace, joy, and freedom. Stand in glory, you will be kings, forever protected by your Heavenly Father. Accept I believe by faith. Believe me, my dear Heavenly Father, I have a miracle. Your name is in my hands. The problems that bother you will find solutions. Even family members who have ridiculed or criticized you will see the change in you and ask for forgiveness for their past actions. They have lost opportunities by neglecting you. But I will lift you up to a spiritual world free of conflict and jealousy, a place where your gifts and growth are appreciated. Get the weight I gave you. Do not mistake my words for a call to wealth. I'm talking about abundant provision, peace, joy, health, and family unity without the burden of debt or depression. Through my eyes, I see your most beautiful, beautiful miracle, knowing that all problems are okay when it comes. Your family will admit they misunderstood you. They will see the truth of your faith, and when they see the great answers to your prayers, they will repent of their blasphemy and ask for your forgiveness. I chose you for a special purpose, not for wealth or fame, but to bless your family and people. Don't be fooled by those who want to accept it for now. Be prepared to compromise and applaud. You work on a high-flying aircraft. Don't be shy about accepting world-famous works. Look at my throne, you are here. With your patience and faith, you will see all my promises come true. You will work wonders for me, 
and I won't ask for that from anyone else. Be careful when accepting cash incentives or promotions. Be content with my love, and remember that I am with you always, and in the peace I give you. My dear child, the drought is over, it's harvest time. Do not look upon past trials as nothing, for the training here prepares you for the great blessings that lie before you. I hear your sighs that seem to be in vain, your questions about when salvation will come. Rejoice, for the fulfillment of my words is near. Open the door, it's time to act on your beliefs. Move forward as a champion, not as someone looking for obstacles or excuses to stay put. Free your heart from the fear of those who imprison it. You were born with wonderful gifts and you are ready to blossom. If you give and share, your home will be filled with blessings. Get ready to harvest, grab your tools, get out in the field and enjoy your work. I will choose you, encourage you and give you strength to win. I will remove the deficiency from your life and fulfill your needs. But be careful, avoid those who oppose my word, waste their time, and blame me when something bad happens to them. They are malcontents and malcontents who do what they want. They want what is not theirs and want to take away the blessings that have been reserved for you. The fruits of the coming harvest belong only to you. Do not throw away this sacred service to the ungrateful in my gifts. Get up early every morning and listen to my voice. I will give you wisdom so that your harvest will be more fruitful than you can imagine. This is the beginning of a new phase in your life and great miracles will happen from it. I will not give you any scraps. Accept them and declare that you love me with all your heart, and today I will change your future. If you are suffering, turn to me and I will heal your wounds. Accept your pain and I will show you love without guilt. I will comfort you with my gentleness. I will not insult you or insult you. This is your reality. You have reached your limit in your own strength. It's time to let me know you need me. You have called me with faith and sincere prayer, so I have come to save you and your family from the wilderness of silence, where loneliness dries up hope and the burning path brings pain. I have come to heal you from the wounds of hatred and deliver you from the pain of life's harsh trials. I fully understand how heavy your difficulties and trials are. It is hard to overcome such pain and keep believing, but my loving hand will hold you I am here to protect you and ward off any harm or evil. Even if your heart is tired and your energy is low, I will restore your happiness. With my help, you will rise from the ashes. Your neighbors and grandchildren will see my blessings for you. I will change your country. I will clothe you with the robes of glory. I will heal you of all your diseases and fill your house with the light of my glory. This is your only qualification because gold can only shine when heated. Thus, you will get rid of any negativity. I don't want you to stand up to look down on others, but to reach out to those who are still crawling on the ground. Let go of all anger, vanity, fear, doubt, and insecurity. Don't look back because everything in the past pales in comparison to your present happiness. Seek high and low blessings, keep them in your heart, and always maintain purity. If things seem difficult today, please listen to me, open up to me. Allow me to bring you peace and use this time to calm down. As the God of the universe, I command the winds around you to stop. You no longer hear the noise of the world or the music trying to hold you back. You may think you are strong, but remember this. Your weaknesses are a reminder that human strength is limited and that you need me. As long as you believe in my infinite power, you are invincible. Your spirit has become strong and indestructible. Among us, you can overcome any obstacle in the name of faith. Resolutely say, my weaknesses are light. I am strong. Walk towards your hope, but you will not stop until you reach the mountain where I am waiting for you. You will reach this mountain because your dreams will come true there, and your dreams will come true there. This is your time, your place. Open your heart and I will work miracles in your life. You are meant to fly. I put you on a high place so you don't fall. Spread your wings and fly. Don't let the shadow of bad news take the smile off your face. You are my favorite child. You have given your heart to me. 
but my Holy Spirit lives in you and defines you. You were faithful to me when many fell into the first stage of doubt and lost faith, hope, and confidence. You are loved by an outside force, and your faith is a miracle. Your lips are full of prayer and work. Now you fly freely. Tell others that they have come out of the wilderness, and I have led them to victory and glory. I did all this because I love you so much. You are my friend, and you have a destiny beyond anything you may know. Listen carefully. I know your heart has been filled with sadness these past few years, and it's hard to accept hope every day. But today, the dark ages are over, and a new era has begun. It is a time of miracles. The wilderness of fantasy and temptation is over. You have defeated the world's attempts to blind you and separate you from your faith. You have fulfilled it. I have come to lift you up and save you so that you will amaze everyone who sees your transformation. Your patience and love for me and your family gave you strength in the journey of hunger and fatigue. My love flows into you, refreshing you. Our covenant was never broken. I hear your voice, and I hear it every time you ask me to pray and call my name. You want to see miracles of miracles, miracles, because of your faithfulness and patience. Your faith in me and your trust in my promises will never fail. I will never leave you because I have thoughts for you, not of evil, but of hope. Tell me your wishes and I will hear from heaven what your heart desires. The day of mourning is over. An hour of your happiness is near. Keep your faith in what I told you. I have loved you from the beginning of the world. I know that love has hurt you before, but I believe that all the words that come out of my mouth are true, and my heart is pure. I love you more than you believe, but you will hear nothing but this from me. Every day, you hear this. I love you. No matter what they say about the past, you can come to me. My arms are always open to you. Do not think that my door is closed to you. My words and actions are the same. I promise to love you. Don't be afraid, and I will never leave you. Come to me with your prayers, and I will listen. I will not let you be afraid, because I am your strength, your music. You will not fail, because you are in my hands. Hear my voice, and walk by my hand. The enemy will come like a storm, trying to wash away your faith. But wait for my promise. Fill your heart with love. Break the tears, know I love you from the beginning. I am your creator and in the heart of my life. You are my true love. It will open the way for miracles in your life, both your health, your financial situation, your family life, and your mental well-being. Believe in my peace and let it surround you. No one will be able to resist my will or overcome my power. Do not fear death, because I am your savior, your guardian. My plan for you is hope and success. Trust me because I have done my best to take care of you. Bless you with everything. Tell me what you want and need, because I will not let you. I love you and I want the best for you and your soul. The more you know and love me, the more blessed you will be. I promise you a new life where you will find happiness, peace and faith that will strengthen you to face all the problems that come your way. When the enemy of your soul tries to bring you down and when Satan hides his fears and worries in your mind, stop and remember these simple words. I love you. I am here. I fill you with peace, joy, and comfort. It may take days or weeks before you see it, but things will be different than before. My peace and strength in you will never change. My love for you will never change. I love you yesterday, today, and forever. My mercy and love are always with you, showering upon you. So go boldly now, even in the dark. Don't be discouraged. The wind will not extinguish the fire I have lit in your heart. But as time goes by, your love for me will increase as your heart clears the problems and pains you carry. I come to you every day to talk to you, to reveal the glorious future that awaits me. Remember to thank me, because through gratitude, you will find the way open to greater gifts. Even if you have a lot of problems and have reason to doubt the end, I will give you patience and make you enter into glory. Keep my promises and my words, because you are a light to those around you, because my words are your life and your light. 
You live in these turbulent, unpredictable days when your plans and dreams seem far away. But I ask you, will you trust me when I tell you that what I have for you is better, beloved disciples? Are you ready to deepen your love for Jesus and bask in his eternal light? Click join now to immerse yourself in exclusive teachings and heartfelt fellowship. Let's walk the path of faith together as we grow in his love and grace. Click join to unite with fellow Jesus lovers on this blessed journey. I chose you for your courage. You may have heard a bad and weak story yesterday, but today, when you hear this, be strong. You are covered, protected, blessed and honored. Know this, your life is about to change. You have lost a lot, but today is the beginning of a new era. Many will be encouraged and encouraged by your faith and strength. Your light will destroy those who turn away from me. I chose you for your courage. You may have heard a bad and weak story yesterday, but today, when you hear this, be strong. You are covered, protected, blessed and honored. Know this, your life is about to change. You have lost a lot, but today is the beginning of a new era. Many will be encouraged and encouraged by your faith and strength. Your light will destroy those who turn away from me. You shine and point the way, piercing the darkness around you. My love has fallen on you like water. You see the same thing. You feel the power of my love. Then you send the blessing to others who suffer, becoming a sign of hope and strength that can only be found through faith. Decide that you cannot do wrong. The wind left him, as if he was a piece of paper blowing in the wind. Lose the sense of failure and focus on my promise. Just trust me. You will know the victories ahead. Always know my presence and remember that I love you. Many things will tempt you. My words are to strengthen you. Life will bring many sorrows and trials, but trust me, you will grow in courage. Do not turn away from all the trials of your life. Face them with your eyes focused on my word and my promise. It is designed to strengthen and support you. I never left you in your weakest moment. Baby, I didn't leave you. I have come to remove your sadness, to replace it with happiness to encourage and support you. When you enter the secret part of your room, shut out the world. I open your heart to prayer and praise. I will listen to you and be with you. Turn your soul to me and I will lift you up. I understand your experience. I feel your happiness and your sadness. When you put your life and your future in my hands and when you share your fears and dreams, there will be joy in heaven. I will send angels to protect you from me. You will receive strength, not by force, but by my spirit. This fight is not yours, but mine. Be careful not to let bad things fill your mind. Those who ask questions about my message, despise my teachings, are disrespectful to me, and turn away from all my blessings for those who are faithful. In times of darkness, you fall before me. My prayers go up to heaven. See how I work quickly to heal you and lift you up with my infinite love and power. I can do the impossible. I am the God of life and resurrection. Do not fear serious illness. I can heal and heal. I will lift you up from the pit of darkness and from the words of bad speculation, and I will give you life, light, and hope. When you encounter an insurmountable obstacle, remember that if you call upon my strength, you can overcome any obstacle. I will part the sea before you and make you walk on the water. Don't let words of defeat and despair enter your heart. Don't let your lies steal your joy and peace. I am your light within you, shining within you, shining so that I may make you rich and give birth to darkness. I am the fire in you, burning to destroy everything that makes you return to darkness. My child, remember that there is no force in your life that can oppose the power of my love and the truth of my promise. Whatever you choose to do, I am here. I will be with you. Miracles are the result. When you look in the mirror, try to see me. I see your wonderful soul, my dear child. When you think about your future, don't forget my promise. As you walk out the door, know that I am with you, walking by your side. Think of it as free, safe, and true to your infinite reward and my love for you. Listen carefully, pay attention to what I say, 
what I give you, and what I offer to satisfy your spiritual hunger and lift your spirit every morning. I know sometimes the numbers aren't bad, mistakes, failures, and disappointments. You think it's too late just to achieve your dreams. Hear me today, don't delay, don't look down. I am writing a new travel map for your soul. Happiness means you don't need love and praise from anyone to be happy. Those, those who do not appreciate your sacrifice will return with a heart of repentance. This is the promise of unfailing love, beloved disciples. Are you ready to deepen your love for Jesus and bask in His eternal light? Click, join now to immerse yourself in exclusive teachings and heartfelt fellowship. Let's walk the path of faith together as we grow in His love and grace. Click join to unite with fellow Jesus lovers on this blessed journey. Remember that I, your eternal Father, love you dearly, protect you, and love you. When you doubt and feel like you've failed, listen to my voice speaking in your heart. Accept these words with love and prepare to receive happiness and contentment in your life. I place my strong hand on your heart, guiding you with divine love. Smile because your soul knows that I, your God, your Almighty Father, am with you in all situations. I will help you gain strength of spirit and clear your mind of the fears and doubts that trouble you. Trust in your heart when you call on me. The prayer of faith will save you. Pray and believe, and you shall receive. With this faith, you can defeat all great men. You trample on the serpent and the scorpion. No matter how you feel right now, you will win. Be wise because you are more than you know. I will give you strength and wisdom. You will correct your mistakes. Your enemies will fear you. My child, rejoice in the divine crown of truth, grace and victory that I have placed on your head. Let me speak to you gently and receive it with a gentle heart. I whisper to you, listen carefully. Sink deep into my eternal love that I command you with authority. Do not be impatient or angry when your prayers are not answered immediately. There are many people around you who are watching you, waiting for you to understand you, but you do not define yourself. You are separated. You have no thoughts of worldly things, but of divine things. Feel free to pray to me and know that I will answer. Blessings are coming your way, but I'm hiding them because I want to prepare you to handle them. Your heart must be ready, stand, be strong, be courageous, and keep my word. We walk together and keep in touch. We share your happy moments in the morning, and you share your fears and dreams in the evening. My words are very true and true, saying that everything, even trials, will end up being a blessing and will enrich your life. If the road seems too narrow, if it is impossible to climb, and your soul needs refreshment, remember this, you will not succeed, you will succeed. You will climb this mountain with renewed joy and strength. The shadows of darkness disappear before my blessings appear. Open your heart to all my blessings, the flow of grace that washes your life. When the burden becomes heavy, the burden of life is near. Sit down, close your eyes, listen to my voice. When I lay my hands on you, I will wash your soul with my living water like a river. You are surrounded by enemies, but there is peace in me. Know that what happens to you today will not be the same as what will happen to you tomorrow, because my word will not return to me empty. My words will fulfill my wishes and fulfill the purpose of my speech. You will go forth in joy and be led in peace. Through this divine blessing, you have the power to fight the world. You are starting a new path in life, a new way of seeing, feeling and thinking. You don't see life's difficulties as obstacles, but as opportunities to grow. You will not be burdened with sadness. You will not be tired. I will give you grace and strength so that you can overcome. You will never experience the feeling of failure again. You will be blessed, my child. Take advantage and use the gifts I have given you. Be kind to those who come into your life and be grateful to those who have helped you along the way. Realize that your success is the harvest of many seeds that others have planted. I have protected you from all misfortunes and brought you to this place. But you have never met another person to celebrate your life. Come among the others. 
let them join your talents and be a gift to others. After all, you spread your gift not only to those who helped you, but also to unknowing donors. Sincerely and freely, don't expect anything in return because you have been blessed in the past. So, this season of giving is your chance to give back and express your gratitude. When you give and receive, you will know that you are truly blessed. Share this video with up to three people if you need God's presence. I have called you to be channels of my love, extensions of my grace in this world. You know what I mean, what I call you. You know my message. You know the gist of what I'm telling you. Please listen to me now. Go and reach out to those you are interested in whom I have placed in your heart. As you give with kindness and gratitude, see me multiply your giving and open the windows of heaven to pour out my blessings upon you. A beautiful expression of gratitude for all that others have given you is not just kindness. It is the means of your freedom, emotions, and wealth. I will break the bonds of debt that bind you. New work and business opportunities will arise under my supervision. Wisdom and counsel will be your friends. Many will be looking for you. Listen to what you hear from me, and one victory will bring another victory. When the world around you is in chaos, thousands of people around you can fall and you won't be there. You will see with your own eyes the reward of the wicked and your family. Your children and all those you love will be blessed. I will remove the thought of lack from their minds. New energy will penetrate them in the form of increased growth, which will enable growth in education, work and career for the benefit of those around them. Those who love me and keep my commandments are like trees planted by streams of water, which bring forth their fruit in due season and whose leaves do not wither. This was my promise from the beginning. Therefore, in times when life's difficulties surround you and despair and failure reign, you will not imitate their system because you are children of promise. You will face difficulties and trials with joy, even if the storms of society surround you. You will stand firm when the world shakes. You will be like the morning sky after the rain, the dawn of a new day. You will shine with the light of victory, for I raise you up as a banner of victory. Anyone who opposes you will feel awkward and frustrated in the middle of the conflict. My peace will be with you and overcome every confusion of fear and anxiety that tries to fight against you. Accept the peace that I give you, this divine and great peace. Breathe in and feel it, my peace. The beautiful feeling of new life that I give you today. Persevere, because my word is sure and true. What I promised you and your loved ones, I will fulfill. You have heard my plan to give you hope. My words will last forever. My plans are made for good. I will definitely do what I promised you. I said it, I wrote it, and I will do it. Fill your heart with peace and joy, because in my love you have everything you need. Trust me, trust my words, and don't think about tomorrow. Don't let negative thoughts take over your mind, because they take away your joy. Cloud your eyes and drain your energy. Instead, let your faith be your lamp and walk with me towards a time full of blessings, a future full of eternal peace and peace. I know that you are being attacked every day, that the enemy is trying to make you look scared, laughing at your efforts, and telling you that your faith is not helping you fulfill my promises. So get up, face every challenge and come with me. Even when you are tired, I am your strength. I will support and guide you on your journey and strengthen your steps. Do not listen to an arrogant enemy who is full of lies. What? Will you listen to a liar? Or will you listen to your God who gives life to everything, who commands even the stormy wind to be still? My power is unlimited. Many people will oppose you, but only I can save you and give you victory. Thousands will rise against you, but by my grace and my love, you will remain safe and exalted. I will support you, bless you and save you. Listen to me, read the Bible, believe in my promises, stay true to my steadfast love and stand firm. I will do great things and perform extraordinary deeds with you and your loved ones. Don't be afraid of your shortcomings because I am the one who takes care of you. Don't let current problems bother you. Instead, close your eyes and let your mind rest. 
Everything is a door you can open. Go forward with courage and knock boldly, for I have commanded you to knock and do not be afraid. I will give you words, walk by faith alone, don't freeze in fear. As you move forward in the action, heavenly windows will open. You will have enough money to give, to give, to bless, to invest. This prosperity will continue day after day, month after month, year after year. Soak it in until it is clear in your mind. Do as I say, eat the scriptures and move forward with confidence. It's time to wake up, strengthen your faith, seize the momentum and light the fire under the vision I've had for you all along. Reclaim old victories, old guilts, decide to persevere, to fight, to do, to keep going despite all the voices that whisper you can't and all the naysayers who tell you it will never work. If you want to listen to God's message and bring positive changes to your life, then subscribe to the channel. This is your faith, your strength, and as you walk, my hand will be upon you, leading you from glory to glory. Forgive, be patient, let go of the past and move on. Stand by my word. Your faith is your sword that will carry you through everything you face. Be firm in your decision. I support your face with success. I am your shepherd, your healer. I know your needs, and I will give you not only what you need, but also unlimited blessings. Tell them you will fight, you will persevere, you will believe with all your heart. Let me hold your ear, turn your eyes to me. I tell you to be brave. Do not be afraid or worried, because I am with you everywhere and at all times, in all difficulties and burdens. With the power of our love, I see your work your attitude, your patience. Talk to me about everything, always with my words on your lips, and I will advise you in time and show you the way you should go. I bless you. You will enjoy a good and prosperous life, and the good you do will be rewarded by pouring out my best blessings in your life. Throughout your life, you will be a generous and generous person known for your wisdom, but admirable for humility. Don't be shy, face the fear. Behind such thoughts is a greater blessing, the cheapest blessing in your life. My son, I am your God. If you love me, you will trust my words. I refuse to work if I give you more than enough. My word is good, and your faith is strong. Even if you don't have courage, you have my rights, and you can commit any crime that comes your way. You protect, no evil will touch you. Whether you are in pain or hurt, you can rest in the safety of my presence. In the midst of your brokenness, you are healed. You are at peace. You are at peace. You are loved. You can enter a hug whenever you want. You will always be my treasure no matter where you go or what you do or what you achieve. You will be my lover. I hold you gently in my love. Come closer. I will encourage you. I will bring you back and gather you from all countries. I will send you back to your country. If you repent and turn from all your sins, you must be forgiven. Accept it because it is yours. That is, today is the day of salvation. Ask, pray and believe until the end and you will receive. Therefore, think about your faith and see how it manifests itself. Then pray for everything you really need. I am giving it to you because you have earned it. In my time, my response was to set your will according to the order of my Lord. Receive what you give, as you are blessed, you should bless others. Show off your wealth, do what you can, when and where you can. Your gifts, your resources, your vision, everything will multiply. Do not be discouraged at the first difficulty. My blessing was born in my heart. Take care of them, keep them, keep them in your heart and pass them on. Share your blessings, save them, plant them, and they will continue to grow. May all blessings be yours. May many blessings come into your life from this day forward. May there be prosperity in your life and home. They support your heart. They support your spirit. They are the refuge of your home and they are yours. When you feel my love, thank me, praise me. Worship me in your heart. The gift of grace is abundant. I hope to give help. Bless and serve those who I put on your path because I have a blessing for those who believe, not for those who do not believe.
or complain, or those who complain. Instead of complaining, and read my words because my promises to you are written there. The details of your blessing, healing, and salvation. Say, I believe, and do good. Now is the time to believe. Now is the time to think, plan, dream. There will come a time when you will call me and ask me to come back, and you too, you will be exalted above the world. Go, and I will be with you. You rebuild and plant. You are like sharp steel. Remember me and go. Blessings of my Lord's work. I give you the peace of my heart. Do not be discouraged because this is an eternal covenant. You will succeed. You will not fail. I will give you strength and power to handle the wonderful things I have prepared for you. You have asked and I will bless you and make you successful. I heard your prayers. Do not be discouraged if it has not been realized optimally for your mind to receive and return to my words, which are your source and the source of your deepest wisdom. Now proceed. Do not worry. I brought you here. I will take you the rest of the way. But I want to witness your devotion, your faithfulness, your perseverance in faith, your devotion. Let your beliefs speak louder than your words. If you give me your whole heart, I will show you that no enemy can defeat you. No slanderer can touch you. No one can harm you. Share this video with up to three people. If you need God's presence. Amen. My child, I am your Father in heaven. Endless love and grace supplied to you. I am the light that will show you out when you have fallen into the deepest valleys. I am your comfort, your shelter, your unwavering strength in your moments of deepest pain. Just as an eagle soars, I lift you up, and my eternal truth heals these soul wounds. I have opened wide the gates to a supernatural world in which you can overcome anything and nothing can really hurt you. The words that are being sent to you today speak peace, a promise of hope driving out your fears and filling your heart with calmness. I am your protector, your ever-present one who watches over your life, now especially when the world's trials face you every day. Temptations lurk at every bend, and enemies seek to destroy you on every side. There are those moments when you feel utterly lost, unsure of whom to trust. Your friends may turn into your enemies, and your family may desert you in the hour of need, but I am there always there. My love for you increases with every passing moment. Do not set hope upon people who are imperfect or on temporary things of this world. Today, I come to reaffirm my eternal commitment to you. I am here walking beside you in this world as you go about your daily business, bearing your burdens, forgiving your sins, pouring out my Holy Spirit upon you. Anyone who tries to harm you will face defeat, those who mislead you, he will bring to judgment. Many will try to bring you low to overshadow the glory, driven by a poisonous feeling of envy residing in their hearts. Now, listen carefully. No man can take you away from my arms of love. Rest in me. Hope in the promises I have written for you. Receive these words as a proclamation of my boundless mercy. Open thine heart and let my divine breath renew thy mind. Thy years be many before thee, yet full of great service to be rendered. There is a holy, wondrous call unto thee, but thy nourishment and strength cometh not from this world, or the things thereof. If you would like long-term and life-altering blessings, on your own and your loved ones, the journey of change, then look nowhere else. You are the only solution lying before me. You are on the right path, keep moving forward. Love me with unwavering devotion. Let me take the highest place in your heart. I long to be your top priority, and I ask for just a few moments each day. You have been picked out and accepted because of my sacrifice and resurrection. Yes, I am aware that you are less than perfect, but I have clothed you with grace. You are not a hopeless sinner trapped in the depths of your sins. Turn to my word when you need guidance. Open your Bible when you seek wisdom. Do not turn away from my servants who guide you, for I will speak through them, as well as through many others. Now, heed my instructions, and you shall succeed. You do know, don't you, that I have not promised an easy life to you. It is always going to be a road of responsibilities and challenges. 
but there is so much difference when a soul like you places absolute faith in me. I put life into your being then. I crown victory on your head. I have seen you robed in righteousness. I empower you to overcome and stand immovable. An unyielding faith pillar, like a rock that stands. An example to those who stumble. To the ones who cling to their own ways. Underestimating the great blessings I am pouring out upon them. Share this video with up to three people. If you need God's presence. It is my joy to make your way straight. To open doors for you. To answer your prayers. I do this by providing solutions that strengthen and guide you through life's storms. I want you to grow up, to humble yourselves, and learn from hardships whenever they cross your way. If you will open your heart toward me, then I will show you a new path filled with my glory, and the impossible shall be possible. People change, the hardest of hearts soften, and your provision overflows from its source. Deaths disappear, sorrow escapes, and joy wraps her arms around you, holding you close. My love and my mercy are always with you, just as they were when you could not feel my presence. I am interwoven into the fabric of your life, witness to each fallen tear from your eyes and each smile from your lips. When the dark times come, I am your light in times of weakness. I am your stronghold in times of uncertainty. I am your sure guide. Trust me, you searched for a message that touches your heart, and I must talk to you about what you keep down deep inside, those secrets which you feel nobody else can see. Yet be assured that we both know. Each morning, as you arise, train your mind not to wander off into distractions or drown into anxiety. Each day give thanks for your family, your life, the time you still have, for a soul who needs to heal. I love you so much and I am merciful forever. I have not punished you according to your mistakes, nor have I abandoned you because of the sins of the past. Do not kill, do not bear false witness against, lie, slander, belittle the man, nor continue in treason. There are many aspects that we could talk about, none more important than the other. Each sin has its heavy consequences. Adultery and sexual immorality do bring down bodies and lives, while gossip and lies and pride and prejudice also cast their seeds of discord, they can destroy families. If therefore you hear these words deep within your soul that my Holy Spirit is speaking to you today, then you have to work doubly hard to seek me every day, to receive my word and to obey without hesitation. I am always near to you. To seek me is to come with faith, believing that I will answer and to patiently wait for the blessings that I, in my perfect timing, will provide. Today, enter my presence and find someone you trust with whom you can open your heart. Your chains will be broken, your guilt and pain left behind. And thus, from now on, nothing shall come in the way of the blessings and the future of goodness and peace that I have in store for you. Be still, shut your eyes. Cry not lest you have no breath left. Every time you stumble, you say so much. Your tears tell of what you need, but my voice heals and comforts you, easing your distress. My love dries your tears and wraps you in peace. It's not yet time to go. Dear child, stay with me a little. I want you to go out from here in a more secured spirit, unafraid to meet life in the face. Walk confidently through dark valleys and desolate wastelands. Feel safe and protected, wrapped forevermore in my eternal love. Trust in it. Have faith. My Holy Spirit surrounds you with love, protecting you from hurt. Feel it. Embrace it. Believe in it. My Spirit will give you passion. It will flood your mind with heavenly peace. It will put laughter on your lips. And it shall give you new vision and dreams that foretell things to come. Yes, immerse in my word. Come. Listen every day. Open your Bible and feed your spirit with its wisdom. Pay no attention to those who come to you bringing apparently great revelations, trying to control your life by false prophecies or threaten you. If doubts ever assail you, it is then that my Holy Spirit shall be there once more to comfort you at any time of the day. He is going to open your eyes and tell you in a whisper that through your Heavenly Father, you are protected and no enemy is going to win against you. 
Say it out loud, declare. My Heavenly Father is with me. No enemy has power over me. Watch your words. Never speak ill about others. Never gossip or lie. Never harm those who are true to you or deceive those who put their trust in you. If you have stumbled in this respect, come into my presence. I forgive your failures and cleanse your heart. Seek me through prayer every morning. I long to free your soul from guilt and regret. I gave my life on the cross and rose again, that you might be free, clear of all mental and spiritual pain. You are but human, and in this world, your body, soul, and mind can become tired. My most faithful servants who lived holy lives got tired and erred many times. They went down humbly, confessing their misdeeds, returning to this forgiving altar, and rose to try again, all without delay. Now come to me if you are weary, if you have stumbled and feel you cannot rise again, if your words have gone too far, if you have thoughtlessly injured someone you love, or if you are bound to some destructive physical or mental habit. Now, if you truly love me and if you believe that I am here to help you, then, my child, come unto me. Let me touch your lips, let me purify your heart, and let me forgive you. But don't return to the same things that make you sin. Because this time, I'm not only renewing your spirit and determination, but I'm making you rise up as a victor. Let go of the burden of guilt and the times that made you feel sorrowful. Now, if you must remember something, let it be happy times and your past victories. Just as you showed faith and overcame before, you will again with the open arms I extend to you. I want to encourage you to stand firm before life with immovable faith and determination. I stand by your side. I love you, champion. You need patience for everything happening in your life, the strength to stand firm. Know that I am here next to you, standing ready to honor your faith. Everything that is happening now has a purpose. You may not see the reasons now, but they are there. And when it is all done, and the blessings that I have in store for you come forth, then shall you realize why it was important to believe, to trust, to be patient, and to wait. You held on and were given much, much more is coming. Join us to deepen your love for Jesus. Tap, join for exclusive teachings and fellowship. Let's grow together in faith and grace. I know how you feel. I know your heart is a book, and there is nothing you can hide from me, even if you tried. You can just come at any time, any hour, any moment, and just freely share your situation, your feelings, for I am always in tune with your emotions and needs. It has always been so. How could you ever feel so low in my eyes when I saved you and gave you a new life? You know love and understanding are few and far between in this world, but here with me, you have it all and much more. Quench the thirst for peace, fill up each passing day with my love, and warm that heart of yours with the power of feeling treasured beyond measure. It is because I love you, and that has not changed. Even at times when you doubted and needed an anchor, my love remained unchanged. I loved you yesterday, I love you today, and I shall continue to love you. Stop trusting those who betray you, pouring affection on those who don't appreciate it, and prioritizing those who have made you cry. They don't deserve it. Never put at the center of your life those who hurt you, whatever happens. Because you know I won't let you fall or be disgraced. Choose your friends well, and don't listen to those who want to discourage you, to steal your faith. You won't be in this difficult season forever. I'll come just at the right time to free you. I know your spirit is tired. Sometimes, these trials shake your faith. But stand strong and remain determined. Soon I shall make firm your steps on the path you must walk, the path that shall lead to my blessings. I know it is hard to wait, and sometimes it seems endless, and there's enough reason to lose hope. But I plead with you to keep moving forward. What you are going through today is a crucible that can forge your inner strength. None shall take away the blessings that come, the gifts I am giving to you, my beloved. Know in the depths of your heart that I claim the highest place. Give it to me freely. Recognize and honor me with the reverence I rightly deserve in your life. Be aware, I should be your God, your Lord, your King, and none other. 
Have you allowed someone else to take the place in your life that rightfully belongs to me? That, my dear, could very well be part of your problem lately. All those churning emotions you feel inside and cannot explain, let me illuminate the darkness in your mind. You feel an aching void within your heart, and that void will expand if you continue to turn your back on my love. It's why, when you wake up in the middle of the night and your face is wet with tears, you feel sad. You long to be loved, but you're looking in the wrong places. Know this, no one in this world can love you as deeply as I can. Come to me, and I will give you peace, love, and rest. What are you waiting for? Do you want to continue giving your life and love to those who cause you so much pain? Are you going to hurt again and again before coming back to me in tears? Even then, I will welcome you because my love is bigger than your mistakes and bad choices. But you don't have to wait for pain to come to run in my arms. You can come to me now. I will cling to you and show you my love. Come today, I am waiting with open arms. Don't lose hope. Today, I'm here to help you. Even before you ask for help, my ears were listening long before your lips parted to pray to me. Remember, I love you and desire to save you from the trials that you face. My dear child, I'm truly pleased by your brave stand in the face of hardship. I want you to hold fast to faith and trust, to trust that I, your true and powerful God, am with you through it all. Shun those who mock you and allow their words to take away your joy. They are not your real friends, people who have lost faith themselves, and so they envy the future that's yours. They realize that you're loved, well appreciated, although they couldn't admit it to their own selves. Do not waste energy trying to convince them or looking for an approval from them. I will get rid of those who harm you from your life and put people around you who truly love you. So do not be desperate. Do not let any worry control you. Allow no peace-thieving thoughts to reside in your heart. Clear out all negative thoughts from your mind and spirit. Protect your mind by wearing the helmet of faith. Put on the helmet of righteousness, the sword of my sacred scripture. Gird up, there is a fight, and you are sure to win. You won't be beaten, and though sometimes you stumble and fall, know surely that I will pick you back up. Take the challenge. Let not fear control your future. Get ready for the hard fight against sadness and anxiety. Give me the assurance that you trust me, and you are ready for success. I shall bless your home and restore health to your body, mind, emotions, and family. You personally see my miraculous power in action. Pay attention. I love you. And at this moment, I want you to believe that fully and honestly. I'm also asking you to come to me each day and feed your soul with my word. Let your faith be on fire, and let those flames burn away the fears holding you back. Never will you reach the promised land if you are still afraid of the fake giants scaring you with their lies. I'm not going to reveal the spoils of victory to a person who won't take one step of faith and lay every strength, struggle, and weakness before me. This is not the time in your life to waste one more minute doubting the good things that I'm about to do for you. Remember. On the cross, your enemies were absolutely humiliated, and I stood in your stead and took the punishment for your misdeeds. Your debt has been wiped out. There are no longer any loads for you to carry. You are now seated with me in the heavenly places, and I have already anointed you with the oil and sweetness of heaven. Be it known unto you, you are not a weak, unimportant person doomed to failure stuck in a life ruined by feelings that steal your right to thrive. I'm talking about real, authentic victory, no more debts, healed finances, forgiveness, peace in your home, wisdom, right judgment in heart and mind, supernatural calm that lets one keep on going. Why are you still going to live your life off of someone else's commentary? I am telling you, stop being a prisoner. For bitter people resentful towards you are looking for chances to take what I want to give. Trust me and my word. Walk away from those wanting to see you fail because victory is found in my presence. And in my presence is where you will triumph. Every morning I will give you strength, joy, and peace. I am here just to whisper loving, nice words to you, great strength and joy. 
I'm bringing favor unto your life and home. Trust, accept, and love me more each day. Come, my child, for today is a new beginning, a day in which you shall experience incredible blessings. And always remember, I am your shepherd, and you shall lack nothing. I am your provider. Everything that you have lacked in life will soon come. I am your healer. I surround you with my love and give you rest. I am your protector. I put my wings over you, and under the shelter of my presence, you shall be safe. My word is truth. My promises are sure. Everything that I told you will happen because I am God, and I don't lie. What I have said, I will do. I will walk with you on the journey that I purposed for you to walk. I am with you at each season and in each situation. And though things go contrary to the impossible, and you feel a miracle just can't happen, trust me fully. Commit your plans unto me each day. I've chosen you to be a blessing to those in your family. Now is the time to prevail and take your life to new heights. Get rid of defeated thinking. Leave old fights behind and step into a new phase of success and restoration. This is the part where I change your life, a new chapter starting for you. Let me lead you into a fresh path of goodness and understanding. I give you my love and my peace so that your heart and mind may be at rest. Thank you for listening to these words because they bring you peace. Listen again, letter after letter, for you will feel my presence right near you, touching your heart and quieting this troubled soul of yours. Share this video with up to three people if you need God's presence. Amen.